In this tutorial, we want to look at how to get a watercolor splash in Inkscape. I'm using Inkscape 1.0. We just go for our create star and polygon tool and then I choose the star and let's give it for example corners 15 and then I draw a star something like this. The color is not really important i just want to show you how to use it so and now we go and pick our um spray objects by uh, sculpting or painting tool and then i come here and then let's just maintain the mode here to copies of initial spray initial yeah, copies of initial selection and the width we leave it as it is and the amount maybe we leave it to 15 and then we do some spraying a bit around okay now let's in case you want your if you want your splash to have this uh, a uniform color then I wouldn't change any of these colors here. First, let's do with having a um, different colors. So I go here now, this, I select some of these and give them some, give them blue colors just to, I can also give some of them yellow. If we want um, our splash to have um, different colors, you know, it depends on uh, what you intend to do if you want only one uniform color then you just you will continue from where i will um start when i finish coloring um whatever i have here now i think this is okay the, uh, and then i you let's select everything and then we group it so we go to object group now we, we we go to filters and then we go to chest textures and then we go to watercolor then you get some, uh, something like this in case you don't you wanted a uniform color and um, let's see here you can just go on and change it to the uniform color that you want you can also put one thing i have to tell you is that um the blur in case when you did it you say oh nothing is coming maybe most of the time when you start doing it and then you've not used it before maybe the blur goes to a hundred if the blur is at a hundred you might not see anything so if you are not seeing anything don't get a panic just uh, reduce the blur a bit adjust the blur as you want to get exactly what um, color um, splash you, you you want to have and then one thing another thing you can do is that you can also give this a gradient so let's say we have um, chosen this thing this color here and i still want to give it a gradient so i can go on and always give it a gradient if you go to object fill and stroke you get this dialog box opened and then um actually this dialog box is open you need it if you want to adjust the blur just for you for you to know and then we go to um we want to let's come to our fill and then we want to give this some form of gradient let's give it a radial gradient so we have something like this and then you can adjust the gradients like you adjust any other objects so you come here and let's say we give this the color i don't even know this color here and then you can put another stop if you want and give it maybe the color yellow then yeah so this is how you can produce a water splash a watercolor splash in inkscape you can use this to produce your logo in case you've drawn something let's say you have any object at all and you want to get this in you can always draw the objects in 
and clip it and then have this as your design thank you for watching please subscribe to my channel to help me and please come again thank you bye